We have prepared our profit and loss statement, but I hope that you would agree with me that we would like to present some of the values that are related to profit and loss statement very clearly on our screen. And these values are gross profit, operating profit, EBITDA, profit before interest and tax, and net profit. Well, by the way, there is gross profit and net profit that we can see, but the other values are not appearing here anywhere. So how do we calculate those values? Well, there are two ways. There is a formula way that is the proper way as well. So we can write a formula that will calculate those values for us. But there is an easier way as well. And I'm going to start with the easier way where we can simply represent that value. We can simply calculate that value using the basic options of page and the filters. So let us do that on the next sheet because, you know, uh, we cannot do anything else in this sheet here. So we will have to add a separate worksheet and only then we can, you know, uh, use these options of filters and these rows and columns right from scratch. And then eventually we will compile together all of that worksheets on one screen, which will be called dashboard. So first step, we have to add a new worksheet here. And I'm going to rename this worksheet as GP that stands for gross profit, just using a short name so that we can add multiple, uh, we can add so many sheets there. And by the way, I don't need that this sheet one anymore. That was just for the basic introduction of Tableau. So I'm going to delete that in from my file now. So we have the profit and loss statement and the next sheet is gross profit. So all we have to do is to, you know, start in the same way. We have to bring together the date from here to the columns. And then we have to bring together the values that is in the GL, the amount to the rows that should be appearing in the table so i will click here and now we have those values in the table and you know these are all the values and i'm not interested in seeing all of those values that are there in my general ledger i only want to represent the gross profit now to calculate the gross profit you will have to present the sales ledger and the cost of sales as well but the smarter way of doing that will be simply work on the trading account let me show you so here we have our chart of accounts. You can definitely go at the sub account level and you can use the filter and you can say that please filter these three ledgers and ignore all of them. Or you can work smartly and you can say please work on the class level and only consider the trading account and these ledgers will then automatically be considered. Both options are right, but of course, this is going to be faster for us. So I will use this filter in my sheet and I will say where classes trading account. So let us go back to Tableau. And now here, let us go to our chart of accounts and bring in the class into the filters. And in those filters, I'm only going to use trading account. Click on apply and click on OK. And now you have your gross profit, which is 2.83 million. 3.968 and 5341. We already have these figures in the PL, so we can verify that as well. So I will quickly navigate to my profit and loss, and you can see 2.383, 3.968, and 5341. These are the same values that we have just calculated here in the cross profit as well. Finally, before I move forward, I will quickly delete this heading. I don't need that, and I will edit my label according to my own style so i will call this cross profit and i will select this text i will change the font to my own style size it accordingly and bold it if you like and change the color to your own style click on apply and that is it so we have this cross profit calculation that we can use on our dashboard now, after the gross profit, we can move to calculate the net profit as well. And of course, we can start at the new sheet and start right from scratch. But the smarter way of doing that will be simply replicate that sheet. To replicate this sheet, I will press the control key on my keyboard. And now I will click on the sheet name and drag it towards uh, the right. And now you will see that a plus icon is appearing there. So I will leave my uh, control key and you know the mouse uh, now and you can see that the new sheet has been added and first of all let us rename this sheet to net profit i'll use np 
and now rather than doing all the work right from scratch i will simply change the filter now you can use the class filter as well or you can go even at the broader level let me show you so here in my chart of accounts you can see if i use the class level filter to go at the net profit i will have to say please bring in the class of trading account then operating account and non-operating and interest and tax there is no harm in that or you can simply use the report filter and say please bring in the profit and loss and you know the net value of the profit and loss report is eventually going to be the net profit you can use anyway i'm going to work with the class level for now because you know i already have that filter available so let's repeat trading operating non-operating and interest and tax let us move to tableau now here i will click here and i will say please you know edit this filter and here i'm going to say interest and tax should be selected non-operating should be selected and operating should be selected so all the balance sheet item and this adjusting should be ignored click on apply and click on ok and you can see we have the net profit and of course we can verify that from our pnl so this is 623 1303 and 1289 623 1303 and 1289 so we have the correct figure of net profit now after that uh, of course we need to change the heading so i will quickly change the title from gross to net profit click on apply and that is it now after that we are going to calculate the operating profit as well ibtida as well and profit pbit as well let us do that in the next lecture